Hello, my beautiful friends. How are you? I hope that you are doing fabulously. I have something really fun to share with you today. I have been working on getting together some illustrations and things to put in my shop. Now, I haven't got them all in yet, but I've got a couple in and I really wanted to share with you what they are. So the first things that I made were some typewriter illustrations. Let me show you, actually. I've got some in here. Here's some that I've got. They look like this. See, they're just cute. They're just little black and white illustrations. And I color them up with watercolor or inks or spray inks or whatever. This one's going to, so you can make a little tag out of it. And I cut them out. Oh, that's got a love note on the back for myself. Um, and I've been, like, sticking them places. Here's one I really love. See how it's got all this pink splatter on it? And I feel like it looks like someone was typing away and working and writing and they've just put their blood, sweat and tears into everything they've written. I just love that one. I love it. And so I've been going a bit crazy and sticking them everywhere. I think I've stuck some. I'm pretty sure I've stuck some in here. Look, there's some. Um, and I love them. They're really sweet. They make good tags. They make good journal decorations. They're just adorable. So, I wanted to show you how they come out. So, this is how you get them in the shop. You can, I've got a couple of versions of them actually. One is a downloadable PDF version like this. So, you literally get just the sheet. And these are about three by three inches each. And you can print them out. I've printed this out onto watercolor paper. And then color them in and cut them out. They're really, really sweet. I'll show you how I do that in a sec. The other version that I have for sale is all of these as uh, PNG files so that you can use them for design, make them bigger, make them smaller. I've got colored ones or um, black and white ones and you get each individual file and you can resize them and do what you want with them, make them into your own art. But the simplest one is just the PDF like this with six different typewriter illustrations. And so, yeah, I've printed these out on the watercolor paper and I'm just gonna do a little coloring in sesh because it's, it's actually really fun. These little typewriters, they make great journal cards. It would be so nice like to stick it as well on the outside of an envelope if you're sending happy mail that would look so cute on an envelope oh too many cool things to do with it um i might have to do that i've got some happy mail i need to send i've got some happy mail videos i need to make so i'll keep some of these to put on those um all right what else i love how it's all blending and merging to me that's awesome i don't want everything in a line i like lots of white space and a really liquidy, blendy kind of, messy kind of thing. Oh, I love it. <laughs> I mean, it's not everyone's cup of tea. You could do it much more neatly if you wanted to. Like some of these are a bit neater. Well, they're still my style, but, well, that's not. But, um, you know, you could, you could be a, a little bit more kind of in the lines and stuff if you wanted to. This is just how I like to do things. <laughs> Distress spray stain is called Hickory Smoke, and I am absolutely nuts for it. It's so cool. It's like grey, but it's smoky grey, and it's just the coolest damn thing. leave these to dry before I cut them out and do anything else with them actually before I go anywhere that needs uh -huh. some more scarlet on it all right guys check it out look how beautiful this is now that the paint has dried and you can really see how those Daniel Smith watercolors dry it's just gorgeous just gorgeous 
Oh, look at that turquoise. Isn't it beautiful? Love it. So these delightful typewriters, I will now cut them up um, into where's some like this or cut them up like this in squares with tags and um, yeah, I'll use them in my journal. I'll put them in happy mail and stick them on the outside of envelopes and just all sorts of delicious things I'll do with them and I will share that with you guys. If you would like to get hold of some of these, then you can find them in my Etsy store. The link to my shop will be in the info box underneath this video. And they're an instant download. All you do is you download them and print them out. I've printed them out onto lovely for, um, watercolor paper. And then that's it, you go for your life. If you do use them, then it would be great if you would send me a pic somehow so that I could see how you use them. I would love that so much. Anyway, that's it. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. I will speak to you soon. Bye.